the last again. season of Game of Thrones. Um, what's yes. going to happen? Well, <laughs> it's a big deal. Um, Khaleesi is going to fall in love with Castiel. Um, it's, a, it's a major, yeah. it's a major oh, crossover season. Quick, I better tweet that out. <laughs> major spoiler. Um, when does that start? Not till next year. Yeah, they have it in the next We're a year away. Yeah. yeah. Uh, it's closer than the last book. They make us suffer. I can't stand it. Well, they're supposed to be like three hour episodes each one. So. Really? Yeah. Anyway, Castiel okay, yeah. in season four. <laughs> Wait, whoa, whoa. We were talking about Game of Thrones here. I'm sick of talking about Castiel. Oh, okay. Um, we were just all right, go ahead. Softening you up so you would spoil things. For oh, okay. Us. Got yeah. smart. Yeah. Good tactic. Um, yes, Cassiel, season So 14. Sam's got facial hair, Dean's got a new outfit. What, what's Cass got going on? Cass has got nothing. Did they give him something? Nothing new for Cass. Um, the newest thing for Cass is that he is, uh, for the first time, getting to exercise his paternal muscle with, uh, with Jack. <laughs> Uh, I shouldn't use that term. <laughs> okay, that's, that's my turn. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Damn it. Sorry. Turtle <laughs> muscle. Um, Is a Is Cass going to have a dad voice? <laughs> Are you going to create a special voice? Oh, yeah. Voice? I, should have, uh, I should talk to him in a, in a particularly cloying, pedantic <laughs> manner, like a father. Yes. Um, and have a look. And have Made a like look. A, a disapproving, exactly. judgmental look. Um, a cooking show maybe with uh, yes, Jack. Yes, cooking fast and fresh with Jack. Um, <laughs> so, um, yeah, he's going to be he's going to be taking Jack under his proverbial wing this season. And literal wing. Uh, well, I don't know for how much of the season, but we certainly start the season that way. And do we have any idea what that sort of looks like, or can you share what it may look like? Um, in the, the sense of him like being human and well, like I, I mean, yeah, I can tell you that Jack is going through a lot of the same emotional turmoil that Cass went through when he lost his powers. So Cass has a lot of empathy and understanding of what that experience is like, and he's trying his best to convey uh, and console Jack. So, um, but those. Jack's went through the same feeling of worthlessness and shame and self-doubt that Cass went through seven or eight years ago. Cass, you know, felt like, well, the, ol the only thing I was good for was, you know, having powers, and now those powers are gone, so I'm nothing but a burden. And that's exactly where Jack is finding himself in the beginning of season 14. So do you feel that uh, Castillo, well, do you know if Castillo is going to have something to really also contribute to the Michael situation, Castillo knows Michael. Is that going to play a factor into how they go after him? Um, well, I can tell you that Cass is, uh, in episode one, he's very tenacious and he's kind of pulling out all the stops and doing anything he possibly can to find Michael and to rescue Dean. Um, even um, even if it means forging unsavory alliances. Okay. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Thank you.